Good afternoon, happy Saturday, May 28th. I think that's the first time I started with a date in a long time. It's 11.51. Can you hear me over the wind? Because I am not closing the windows. I don't have my makeup on today. There's Mrs. Holly. I wanted to do makeup today, but I ain't got time for that. I have tinted chapstick on. You're not going to be able to hear me. I'll close one window halfway. We, and by we, I mean Reese, Noah, and Luke. We are going to We Is otherwise known as Wise Market. It's spelled W-E-I-S, we is. Because um, I have Luke in flat diapers with a kite fold and a soaker inside folded up. But the poor child has a rash. I don't know if it's just because um, it's hot, so I'm making the kids drink a lot more and he's just really, really wet. out of all these rocks. Yes, Mrs. Holly was out doing her garden. It's a good day to be out doing yard work except for the fact that it's hot. Like humid, 90 something, like 98% humidity. I'm not complaining. I actually really like it. So I'm going to buy Luke paper diapers. I don't know. I wish, does anybody out there know? I wish I had a cloth diapering friend who could help me. I I don't know, is this how it is with flats? They're just not as absorbent. They're definitely not as, as absorbent as paper diapers. Paper diapers, disposable diapers. So we're gonna clean up this, clear up his rash, and I'll strip his diapers because even though they're pretty brand spanking new, half of them anyway, I don't know, maybe there's residual yuck in the diapers. They don't smell bad. Maybe there's residual detergent in the diapers. So anyway, that's where we're going. We're going to Wea's for diapers. My husband is starting to heal. Well, I mean, he started to heal a while ago, but like he was awake this morning. He walked around the house a little bit more than normal, which is what he's supposed to be doing, taking short walks. He has to get movies for him at the Red Box. I need to make shorts for the kids. I bought the cutest cargo shorts pattern on Etsy to make shorts for the kids. And then I went shopping on Etsy because I don't leave my house. But I need the fabric. I was gonna buy fabric to make the shorts, and my husband's like, I'm gonna be missing work, don't buy anything. So, I'm gonna go Julie Andrews, Julie Andrews, Julie Andrews on the pattern, and use old sheets. I have really pretty purple fabric, and I have really cute stripey fabric. You know, purple for the Gracie gal, stripey for the boys. Mikey actually wants purple, so I could probably make everybody several types of shorts. So, that's my plan. I have a ton of laundry to catch up on today, and I need to make the kids shorts. Because it's hot. I wasn't ready. I just wasn't prepared for this weather. Weather. And the other day, I was going to take the kids out to buy shorts, and then, you know, my husband's gallbladder to be all infected so then he had a surgery and also not only did he have his gallbladder taken out but they fixed a hernia so he's just in a lot of pain he's gonna miss a lot of work this is like stories from the nostril cam adventures from the nostril cam okay I'm done with that uh, what else did I want to say I really wish I would have gotten up really early this morning well, I was up early at like 6, but I wish I would have t gotten up and gotten dressed and went straight to the trail for a walk because um, it would have, it just, it's just a beautiful day to walk. There's a lot of traffic here. Oh, this person is causing a problem. U turn. So we're going to go tonight. I'm going to, oh crap, I can't go tonight. My father-in-law is going to pick up Mikey in the van and Mikey's going to go mow, which has me a little stressed out over at my in-law's house. I wish I were the one mowing, but whatever. So we're not going to be able to go to the trail tonight because tonight I won't have the van. Whatever. I'll get on the treadmill and the air condition. So I'm going to YouTube some tutorials on how to make shorts because I also can't download my awesome cargo shorts pattern that I just bought from Etsy because I'm out of printer ink. And my husband's like, don't you dare buy printer ink. He's He's being very, very wise right now because you want to save your money when you don't have any income, you know. 
And while he has no sick days, he's using all of his vacation time, and then there'll still be like one week of no pay. So we got this. You know what? We don't got this, but the Lord's got this. I'm not worried about it. But I'm also not going to go buy fabric or printer ink. Okay, I'm babbling. Talk to you later. today. Go ahead. I love rice. It'd be great if you love the rice somewhere different than in front of the camera. He's very brazen. Stop it, Mom. Stop. I'll tickle you if you do it again. He's having fun. Good job, Luke. Luke, mommy is so proud of you. I can't even believe how happy this is. He loves it. This one's like, you guys are a little excited about something I just don't get. It's so cold. I bet it is. Oh my gosh. Luke is really surprising me. She's like up and down, up and down. You guys are probably scaring the baby birds. It's freezing. The baby birds are right below them, like over here somewhere. Oh, you're scaring our baby birds. It's okay. Oh, hey, our little baby bird. It's gone, it's gone, it's gone. Well, if it's still inflated by tomorrow morning, it should warm up a little bit. Oh, snoozer. Oh, let me get him. I know. Five minutes. This is the pool I was supposed to give birth in. I labored in it. Whoa! No, I don't know if it's big enough for that. Oh, it is! You guys are gonna pop it and then you won't have. Oh, Lukey, are you okay? Okay. Maybe I should put the camera down. Absolutely not, Grace Elizabeth. Maybe we need to set up some ground rules. Oh, excuse me. 